What's up everybody and welcome to the channel. I'm Salty Sleggy and today we're going to talk about Kina and the Bridge of Spirits. It's developed and published by a small studio called Ember Labs. It originally used to be an animation studio. It's exclusive to Epic Game Store for PC, PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5. It's a third person action adventure semi open world type game. And it's their first game. And I think visually it looks incredible, stunning and beautiful for their first type of game. The story follows Kina, a young spirit guide who uses her magical abilities to help deceased people move from the physical plane to the spirit world. It has comparisons to Zelda, most would call it a Zelda light, it's got light puzzle elements, there are no load screens on death, no load screens on cutscenes, the performance apparently is flawless. There are four biomes, a forest, a ruin, a village area which you'll class as your hub base, a perilous mountain range and one other area. The combat is simple with light attacks, heavy attacks, you'll unlock the bow eventually, you'll use it to traverse, you'll unlock the spirit bomb which will give you the opportunity to throw, use your bow and then the rocks will actually levitate and you'll be able to rotate them and it also has a parry system. The boss fights are very Dark Souls inspired. The playtime is between 10 to 15 hours, depending how quickly you're progressing through the game. There are enemies in the world. There are subtype mini bosses in the world. The upgrade system is minimal at best, and it's simple, and it leaves it open to flesh it out more for the future if this game actually does get a sequel. I'm very intrigued by this game. I'm actually stunned by how good this game looks. And that'll be it for the video. I hope you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that notification bell if you're interested in these types of videos from this channel. I would love to hear from you down in the comments below as well. And drop a like for the algorithm so more people get to see videos like these in the future. And until my next video, I hope you have a wonderful day. And I'll see you next time.